That's it, blame the intern. Even reading that I assume the failure is having a system that can easily be broken by an intern in the first place. If one dude takes your system down, it's 100 your fault. It's good to know everybody else is also just around. I wonder if he misses his job being in charge of the incoming missile alerts in Hawaii. To quote that Russian guy from Iron Man to your software. When a company can publicly say that they narrow down the blame to one person it's a huge sign that this company isn't a good fit to work for. They just use this one person as a scapegoat for the fact that either they don't have proper procedures that act as safety nets where changes are reviewed by multiple people or they are allowing individuals to bypass these processes based on that individual's sole discretion. Either way they should know that that's a terrible way to go about it and they're responsible for letting it happen. QA testers actively hiding in the corner. Accidentally taking down production is a rite of passage. We've all done it, cool face. Where else am I supposed to test my changes besides production? All I did was change threads 1 to threads 10 to improve performance. 